Tell him, baby. Tell him. So here we are. We're um, we're gonna show you how to um, how to make the actual trap. On the other video, we have uh, how to set it up on the loft, and this is what we set up. And we're gonna talk a little bit about safety on this, because I have seen many people that have got um, actual bulbs or some type of wires on it, but they don't move. And uh, to me, it's not really recommended that it doesn't move, because if it's not wide enough and the bird decides to go back, he can get hurt. The birds can get hurt. And another thing is the, the space on the last one right here. Uh, I've seen them, people, this thing don't move, he move all together, and they are too close to the side. So if a bird stick his hand, his head over here, and when every, everybody's coming at one time, if he tried to pull back, um, this don't pull back, um, and it might hurt. So we put a separation right here on the side, okay, for safety, so that way the head can fit in it, in and out. And this, it moves one at a time, okay. And I'm going to show you how easy it is uh, to set this up. And then uh, the reason why we use this, and we got a little box on the front with little arches. Um, the reason is because um, some other people uh, make a solid piece of uh, plywood or something, and that's the trap. You just lift it like that, and the birds go in. Okay, but when you do that, if you have an attack on the loft with the hogs or something, um, if they get to the trap, they might fall in the trap. Okay, and then wh what's going to happen with the bird is hunting your birds is inside of the loft. Uh, who knows what's going to happen? Never happen to me. I hope it doesn't happen. But the reason that's the reason why we use this type of trap. We use this type of trap and we put the little arches in front of it. If there is an attack, the your pigeon can still go in the loft and it's got this trap and it's got the other thing in the front of it. And right? Is that how we do it? Is it? So we're gonna show you how to set it up and on the other video we also tell you um, how it's set up in the loft. You can go and watch the other video too. So now we're gonna um, show you how to make it. Okay, here we are. We're trying to fit this together. Ethan has already got his already finished. And I'm gonna finish mine. I got the, I stapled this part and this part. This is a 40, 45 degree uh, cut on, on here, angle. And uh, I already do the spacers on the side. I staple it on there and put a hole through it. I pre-cut this wire here with an L shape. Okay, it's gonna go inside like that with the bob and then on the side I'm gonna hold it here with a little nail okay so it's not gonna come up okay it's not gonna come up so I'm gonna try to hold it in place and then I got this wire that I already cut that is gonna go on here this is um it makes noise when the bobs drop on it I kinda like that and then uh, when they were the birds go in and also, you can use it um, to lift um, all the bulbs at one time and leave it open. I never use it that way. Um, but we just put it there anyway. Then I'm going to show you how to finish this up. Okay, we got the, see the other piece on the top. And I, what I want you to see is how, how easy we do it. So, um, you can do it yours also. I mean, this is um, twenty, thirty dollars on the store. Okay, but if you can see this, I'm just um, I'm just got this is forty-five degrees. This piece is ninety-eight cents, and the bobs is uh, uh, seventy-five cents um, on the store. So you just get the bobs and um, piece of wire. Like this, so we're gonna install this real quick with the bobs on it. And uh, we make these type of traps because we can use the same type on all the areas on the loft, and um, it'll be the same, the same shape, and everything. So you can make as many as you want. Then if you buy uh, any type of wood or whatever, you can do it. Um, 
So now we're going to put a little nail right here and a leaf. Okay, so we're going to put this nail here and we're going to bend it to the side. So that way it's not going to be on the way when we slide it into the slot like we show in the other video you can go and look at. So you see it's not going to come out. Your box is not coming out. So that is your trap in two minutes. Um, this is to lift everything at one time. Okay. Everything moves at one at a time. You got space that the head of the bird can fit in. If they decide to pull back, it's not going to get trapped on, the, on your trap okay and it's safe to use and you can look at the uh, other video where we uh, show you how to set this up but this is your trap and now we got two traps in a few minutes okay you can make your own and it's safe y'all have a great day and thank you for watching